my name is Miss Tina and I work at the Deer Run Library and welcome to Tweens and Teens Create. Today we're going to be making um, art from a picture frame. Uh, we did have some take and make kits. If you were able to get one of those, you will have in that take and make kit a frame and a sharpie. If you were unable to get a kit, you will need a picture frame and a black sharpie. You will also need to have some paint and paint brushes um, and a, f a picture of some kind to trace. So um, I'll show you how to do it and then uh, you can do the same. And then when we're all done, when you finished your creation, I would love for you to send me what you've done so I can see it. All right, let's get started. So the first thing you're going to do is find a black and white photo. It really doesn't matter about color because you're just going to be tracing this. So um, get yourself an eight by 10 uh, drawing picture, something black and white that you can trace. I did cut mine down just a little bit to make sure that I could get the picture to fit. Then you're going to take the glass part of the frame and pop it out of the frame. And then you're going to take the picture and tape it onto the frame so that you're able to trace over it on the opposite end. So now take your Sharpie. Now it is important that you use the type of Sharpie that I have put in the bag, the fine tip Sharpie. The one that I'm using um, did not work for me. I had to wipe this down and start over again. So you wanna make sure you're not using the ultra fine tip Sharpie, that you're using a fine tip Sharpie. And just trace everything on your picture. Just keep tracing until you get your picture completely traced. Sometimes you might need to take it off just to see how you did, but just make sure not to mess up your uh, lines you've already done. Also, one of the cool things about this project is if you mess up, even after the paint has dried, you can use an alcohol wipe or go into the kitchen and just wash it off and it will come off. Alcohol wipe will get the permanent marker off and the paint will just wash off. So um, if you do make a mistake like I did, you can start all over again. It's not a big deal. acrylic paint you really can't use anything other than acrylic because you need it to be as thick as possible so that you can't see any sun shining through the other side so just make sure that you are layering this um, do multiple layers and every once in a while just flip it over and make sure that you can't see through and it doesn't matter if you go over the black marker on this side, all that matters is what happens on the other side. Like I said, just keep layering and layering. Um, you don't have to keep the paper on like I did. You can take the paper off and paint this. This just helped me make sure I stayed in the lines a little bit easier. Um, but just keep painting and you'll see my finished product in just a minute. Right, here's the finished product um, this is the opposite side so this is the, pa the painted side so this is the side that was painted you can see how it's um, layered then you flip it over and it is beautiful you can't even tell that it was painted on the other side I would love to see yours just email them to me and I hope you enjoyed